Solarbright Green Greg here, and in this video, I'm going to answer the questions, will solar panels ruin your roof? Will solar panels put holes in your roof? And lastly, will solar panels cause roof leaks? I'm going to answer all those questions in this video, so stay tuned to the very end. So understand, a solar contractor doesn't just put holes in your roof, they use a solar mount. This is one example of a solar mount. This is a flashing made by Iron Ridge. The top part of this flashing tucks under the shingle above it. There's a raised hole, so water just can't just roll into the hole. There's also a rubber washers around the lag bolt. And lastly, there's roof cement underneath this flashing to seal it up against the roof. So you got several layers of protection against any water infiltration. However, I have seen a lot of do-it-yourselfer systems, and let's face it, if you look online, if you look on YouTube, there's plenty of videos about do-it-yourselfers trying to install the solar system themselves. And unfortunately, they're doing it to save money, right? And one of the ways they cut and save money is by not using a roof lashing, but just using a bunch of roof cement and a lag bolt through the roof. Now, this may initially hold up. However, over the years, all roofs get hot during the daytime and then they cool off at night. And you get that day after day, year after year. And so what happens is this adhesive eventually will fail. And that's why it's important to have a roof lashing or an appropriate solar mount. Now you may ask, why would somebody not use the appropriate solar mount? You see these roof lashings Depending on the local climate, you may need about 100 to 200 of these solar mounts. And that can run anywhere from $1,500 to $3,000. And that doesn't even include labor, that's just the mounts. So whenever you see a do-it-yourselfer install package, and yeah, it's a few thousand cheaper, or heaven forbid you have a solar contractor who's trying to give you a real low ball price, this might be one of the areas they're cutting back and trying to save a few thousand. So be very, very careful. And it might be very tempting to save a few thousand, but let's face it, if you have a roof leak, it can cause thousands of dollars in damage, mold, and other problems to your home. And you just don't want to mess with this. So you want it done the right way. Okay, so you may be wondering, that's fine, but what is the warranty on these solar mounts? Well, here is Iron Ridge, the one I showed you. Let's see what their warranty is. Okay, it says right here, 25 year warranty. Most solar panels have a 25 year warranty also. So 25 and 25, that's perfect. That's what you're looking for. But what if you have a different type of roof? Let's have a look. So here's an example of a tile roof mount. They do both curved tile as well as flat tile. This company's called Sunmoto. Let's see what their warranty is. Okay, they have Manufacturing defects warranty of 25 years and five years for finish. So 25 years warranty, just like the solar panels do. Very nice. Not so much worried about the finish warranty. These mounts are underneath the solar panels, so you will barely see them, if at all. But what if you have a metal roof? So here's a metal roof mount company called S5. They make all different types of mounts and clamps depending on what type of metal roof profile you have. Let's see what their warranty is of S5. Okay, so S5 has a lifetime warranty. So obviously they have to be very confident to have that kind of warranty. And this company's been around a long time, by the way. So their product, I can tell you from experience, does hold up. Okay, but what if you have one of the new metal stone roofs? These are becoming very popular, especially in the high-end homes. So you may be wondering, how is solar mounted to this type of roof? And also, what is a warranty of that solar mount manufacturer? So let me show you. So first of all, this manufacturer says installing solar mounts. Quick bolt stone coated steel roof mounts can be used for installing solar arrays with Takora metal roofing products. These mounts were designed in collaboration with SES roof manufacturers and come in a variety of fixed and adjustable styles. Okay, so they actually collaborated with QuickBolt. Let's see how it's installed and what the warranty is from QuickBolt.
Okay, you see that there? So he had it screwed down to the decking underneath here. This metal roof panel clips in, and so water cannot infiltrate and get underneath there because this clips in, okay? So that is a foolproof method. Let's see what QuickBolt's warranty is. We warranty products free from defects in materials and manufacturing for 25 years. Okay, so I think you can be very confident with QuickBolt, especially since it was recommended by the manufacturer. And from the mechanics of it, it looks like it's very robust and you're not gonna have a problem with any water infiltration. Just make sure, of course, you have a licensed solar contractor or electrical contractor that's familiar with solar. All these solar roof mount manufacturers are doing 25 years, and one of them was even doing lifetime warranty. So this should tell you something, that these mount manufacturers are very confident in their product. Many of these companies have been around many years. So it is a robust way to mount solar without having any roof leaks. Remember what I said, most roof leaks are caused by do-it-yourselfers, and occasionally you might get some low-ball contractor who's not doing a solar mount, that's where you get a problem, okay? If it's done the proper way, you will not have roof leaks, you will not ruin your roof. So Solar by Green Greg here, and on this channel we cover home solar PV, solar pool heating, and energy efficiency. And I do it all without any sales talk. You see, I've been doing solar since 2007, so I know all the insider secrets, all the tips and tricks, but I'm also a homeowner just like you, and I know how it is. You don't want sales talk. You're just trying to get information or maybe do some quick troubleshooting. If that's you, you just want information, hey, you're in the right spot. Go ahead, hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Oh, and by the way, in the comments, pop in there where you're from. And if you have a topic you'd like me to cover for a future video, put that in the comments too. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great sunny day. Bye-bye for now.